Hello again, this is Bishop Doherty. I'd like to apprise you of the latest developments called the Continental Synod. You can see here the synod we've been working on for over a year has begun to give me a pretty fat binder full of stuff. Um, and where are we now with it? Um, you were all participating in the diocesan synod. Everybody was invited. We had tons of meetings, uh, over 800 pieces of feedback that we digested. Uh, then we have a national digestion, and that came about into a document a few months ago. And then they added what they call the continental level. And so people from the United States and Canada had about six Zoom meetings in language groups of French, Spanish, and English uh, to talk about their experience of discipleship in their part of the church and where they felt the Holy Spirit might be guiding them to. I was a part of that as an American bishop, so my little group of about 10 people, half Canadian, half uh, American, U.S. American, I should say, uh, was very interesting. Um, one of the little tidbits of information that came out of this was the subject of how immigration is experienced. Uh, uh, how they're experiencing this in the Canadian church. And a Ukrainian bishop in Canada said they'd already taken in 140,000 Ukrainians, and by the end of their process, they will take in 650,000 Ukrainians into Canada. Um, you know, that's almost hard to imagine. But then at the other end, a bishop from Texas was also in my group. And as you know, immigration is a huge issue for them as a church, which likes to provide accompaniment and mercy. Apart from all the political wrangling, there are lots of hungry people and families with children that have to be taken care of in these journeys. Uh, and it's affecting the way we think about our church and our faith. Um, but the whole purpose is to evaluate how we're doing as disciples, as believers in Christ. And so this Continental Synod was another stage. It will be digested, and eventually all these from around the world will come together in a meeting of bishop delegates in Rome next year. So um, there's a lot going on. I just thought you should know a little bit about this. Uh, it wasn't just in your parish or in our diocese. This is a worldwide phenomenon, and it's a process that's continuing. God bless you all.